Well, here, you know, the Stillaguamish tribe here, they are a sovereign nation, and therefore they can um, do things different, things, things separate from Washington State, the rest of the state. So the casino is choosing to open this afternoon at 3 p.m. However, they are only opening at 50% capacity, and when you show up, things will be very different from normal. In fact, from the start, when people show up, they're going to have to check in at the front of the casino, then wait in the parking lot for a text message to their phone that says it's their their turn to enter. Once they get inside, they're going to have a temperature check. They're going to be expected to wear a mask inside the building, and then there will be other changes. Things like there will be no sitting at the bar or smoking inside. They'll have plexiglass that separates people from the cash and food stations. And then, of course, people inside are going to be expected to follow social distancing. Because we believe it's time. We believe that we have enough safety protocols in place that are very similar to other industries that have not shut down. If people are, are concerned with that, uh, do not like the decision, I would encourage them to stay away at this point. Now, new this morning, I spoke to one of the casino's employees, an employee over the age of 65 that asked to remain anonymous. They told us they're worried about returning to work too soon. In fact, the last time we spoke yesterday, they said they weren't returning today. They're not sure if that means they'll lose their job or unemployment benefits. They say right now they're working with the casino's human resources department to figure that out. I did reach out to the casino to ask them if there was a plan in place for employees who are over 65 or those who are high risk for coronavirus. The company told me they have no comment at this time. Again, casino doors set to open 3 p.m. this afternoon. Live in Arlington, Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.